So this is just a quick video on how to prepare your Family Tracker of Song for use with the um, the Family Tracker MIDI converter that I just wrote. So all you really need to do is make sure that you have no repeating um, patterns. All it has to be organized to be o o o o one 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 two 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 three 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 four like that. Um, if your song isn't like that, just um, start a new program and just copy all your patterns, your sample, your instruments and stuff, and just copy all your patterns over to just look like this. Make sure that the 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 the, the, um, the pattern layout looks like that. Um, it's only going to convert at this point in time the pulse channels and the triangle channels. The noise and the sample channel will be ignored. Those um, we're probably going to deal with the noise channel in a future update and try to implement drums or something. Um, effects and volume changes are also ignored. Those will also come at a later date. This is solely just to convert the notes over to MIDI file and it'll be converted to a three track MIDI program, each channel being its own track. Um, the tempo will be stable and like it's not going to, it's a pretty bare bones program, but it's designed so that to be a jumping point. So if you wanted to actually write a song um, with a lot of like stuff in it, you could use a MIDI program like Jazz MIDI Composer or something else to fully edit your songs and to add or change any of the stuff you want to. But this is merely just a note trigger converting program to direct so that you can. It's, it's open-ended, really. Um, yeah, that's about it. Uh, this is just a simple demonstration of what you can do with it. Right, so that's pretty simple. And this was the actual output that MIDI Fem generated. Thank you for watching, and here we go.